Hello Capricorn, welcome to your weekly reading. So we're going to pull on some love energy. We're going to see how your person feels about you. This could be somebody who you're in a relationship with, you're in separation from. This is a general reading, so not every message is going to resonate. Just take what applies, leave the rest. It's also timeless, so whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages could apply to your life the most. Of course, some of the energy could be switched, so you know your story, place yourself where you fit, and let's tap in. Spirit, give me some energy for Capricorn. How does Capricorn person feel? What is the message? Messages for Capricorn. How does Cap... Okay. <laughs> Judgments. I'm hearing like offering. Somebody wants to come bring you a peace offering. I'm looking at how her hand is extended on this card. Somebody wants to make amends. And then we have the moon, cancer, no, the star. Sorry. Aquarius energy. So something is fated to happen for some of you. This is going to be a reconciliation or this is at least what this person wants. Somebody wants to reconcile with you. Why is judgment here? for Capricorn somebody definitely wants to make peace make amends um this is looking like a cross to me so it's like somebody could have been on their religious journey their spiritual journey going through an awakening somebody definitely has changed they have upgraded it's giving me emperor energy somebody could be a fire sign or have Aries highly aspected you may want to go watch that reading give me an energy for judgment why is judgment here for Capricorn what is the message why is judgment here? I have the nine of cups. You know what? Happy. That's what I'm hearing. Like happy. Like you make somebody happy. Somebody sees you like as their peace. Give me another energy for judgment. Why is judgment here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is judgment here? Page of swords. Somebody wants to communicate. Somebody wants to tell you how they feel, but it's just giving me also with the Nine of Cups that this person has been working on themselves. Somebody has been on their healing journey. Give me an energy for the Nine of Cups. Why is the Nine of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the message? Why is the Nine of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Queen of Wands. Tell me more. And the Ace of Wands. Somebody wants to move forward. Somebody wants to move in as well. Somebody wants to live with you, Capricorn. Give me an energy for the Queen of Wands. That's not going to resonate for everyone. Somebody definitely views you as being very attractive. The Hierophant, Taurus Energy. Somebody wants to commit. So somebody wants to pretty much take you off the market. Give me an energy for the Queen of Wands. Why is the Queen of Wands here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Queen of Wands here? The Sun. Um, Leo Energy. Somebody does view you as wish fulfillment. Somebody wants to commit. For some of you, I'm even getting like this person is willing to travel to you. Something has to do with the state of Texas for some of you. Give me an energy for the sun. Knight of Cups. Yep. Somebody wants to come in and make you an offer. Um, give me an energy for the Ace of Wands. The Ten of Swords. So... I feel like for some of you, either you or this other energy went through a situation where healing needed to take place. Somebody had to heal. For some of you, somebody was waiting on a divorce to be finalized. I'm hearing decree for a relationship to finally be over before they came in. Give me an energy for the Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Ooh, because whoever this person was um, in a relationship with is very vicious. Like, somebody can be very disrespectful. Somebody's very manipulative, a liar. Somebody also talks a lot, but they rarely have anything to say. Like, somebody's... <laughs> 
getting out of a very toxic relationship. Give me an energy for the Ten of Swords. The Seven of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. Um, I feel like this person is going to, to ask for you to come back. They're going to beg. Somebody feels like they need to beg. I'm hearing um, bended knee. I think that's my voice to men. Like Somebody is going from a boy to a man or from a girl to a woman. Like Somebody is growing up here. They're taking accountability. Um, Ace of Swords, something has to do with righteousness. Something has to do with someone's evolution, their spiritual evolution as well. Somebody seeing the truth, accepting the truth, even telling you the truth about this other situation. Give me an energy for the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here for Capricorn? What is the energy? The Five of Pentacles. Okay, so this person left you out in the cold. They did walk away from you. And Ace of Swords, they have to come and bring you the truth. I'm hearing deliverance. Yeah. <laughs> so whatever this person been through, um, it was a blessing in disguise. Because it really did put someone... On their spiritual path like getting them connected to the divine to source their calling like it really changed someone it transformed this person give me an energy for the page of swords why is the page of swords here for capricorn what is the energy i have the hermit somebody could have even ghosted you somebody has to tell you why they ghosted you Give me an energy for the Five of Pentacles. Somebody ghosted you for this Queen of Swords in reverse. For some of you too, this Queen of Swords in reverse, like, it's giving me dictatorship. It's very controlling. Whoever this feminine energy is, of course, this could be a masculine as well. Told this person not to talk to you. Somebody encouraged this masculine or feminine to distance themselves. And, and they listened to this Queen of Swords in the reverse. Eight of Wands. Yeah, something has to do with this person walking away. Whoever they chose to listen to pertaining to you. Somebody took some advice and it was the wrong advice. By someone that was just secretly trying to sabotage them anyway. Sabotage, I'm hearing the union, their union. So something should have been came together. But, you know, somebody chose to take another path. They wanted to believe someone else who was a manipulator. Give me an energy for the star. Now give me something for the hermit. Why is the hermit here? For Capricorn. What is the energy? Why is the hermit here? For Capricorn. What is the message? I have the moon and the four of cups. It didn't matter like what this person did, like for some of you, this person tried to go out and have fun, but it's reminding me of this girl right here sitting there. Like even though she's at the party, she's not really there. You know, somebody is mentally gone. They're not even um, aware of what's happening around them. That's this masculine or feminine energy. Like somebody just couldn't stop thinking about you. The moon. There was a lot of hidden emotions here, hidden feelings that this person never expressed. And it didn't matter how much they tried to get away from those thoughts, those feelings, they never could. Like, someone could have tried to do things in order to distract themselves, but it didn't work. Somebody was always brought back to a certain place. And that certain place has to do with you, memories of you. Um, I'm hearing surrounded by you. Then I'm hearing Eve's by you. Something has to do with that. Somebody's name could begin with the letter E. Surrounded by you. So for some of you, this person wished that you were there or wherever they were. Like when this person would go out, 
they would wish that they were with you instead of at their present location. Somebody always longed for you. Give me an energy for the star. Yeah, somebody was very distant. They were unhappy. They really were. Give me an energy for the star. Why is the star here for Capricorn? What is the energy? I'm hearing Who's That Girl, the song. I think, don't Eve sing that song, Who's That Girl? I'm telling you, like, you left a mark on this person's life. Like, you're so different. Somebody never encountered an energy like you. Like, you really left a mark, a, a huge impression upon this person. I have the Knight of Cups. I feel like they they want a faded meeting, a faded encounter. I feel like this is going to happen, Capricorn, to be honest. You will run into this person. You will see this person again. Give me an energy for the star. Something could also have to do with you um, going on vacation, Queen of Pentacles. So this is your energy. You're definitely focused on your money, your career. For some of you, too, you could be getting into like... um herbal remedies i'm hearing healing i'm hearing herbal properties give me an energy for the knight of cups this person watches you if you do anything online especially if you're if you are a healer you talk about any type of remedies healing remedies you deliver any messages Give me an energy for the Knight of Cups. Why is the Knight of Cups here for Capricorn? How does that person feel? Six of Wands. Somebody knows they will be very successful with you. Like they know the relationship will work. Something has to do with a faded encounter. Like a faded meeting. Um, give me an energy for the Knight of Cups. I feel like I'm hearing wish up on a star. So I feel like this person is praying. Somebody could be listening like to just a lot of different music, love songs. And that's constantly reminding this person of you as well. Somebody could be listening to Boys to Men. Now I'm hearing end of the road. Give me an energy for the Knight of Cups. Why is the Knight of Cups here for Capricorn? Five of Swords. Tell me more about the Six of Wands. Um, whoever this person was dealing with or is leaving behind, they argue over you. Like, they talk about you, Capricorn. Like, whoever this masculine or feminine energy is connected to, they know about you. Of course, they know about you. For some of you, this person, this is Queen of Swords in the reverse. This is somebody, again, I'm hearing a dictator. Somebody is very controlling. This is the person that told this masculine or feminine not to talk to you, not to deal with you. Somebody told this person that you were bad news because they wanted this energy for themselves. Somebody was in competition. For some of you, the, this person has children with whoever this five of swords energy is. Give me an energy for the six of wands. There can be a lot of public spats, a lot of public disagreements as well. Give me an energy for the six of wands. Why is the six of wands here for Capricorn? Strength in the knight of swords. I'm hearing can't get over you. This person cannot let you go. You, For some of you, you could feel this person pulling on your energy. You may find yourself thinking about this person randomly. Heavy Leo energy in this reading. For some of you, this person could be a Leo or have it highly aspected. Somebody rushed into this other relationship too quickly. And it had a lot to do with this person's image, pride, ego, and now it's horrible over there. Give me an energy for the Five of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles. For some of you, these people argue a lot about money, finances, Nine of Pentacles, yeah. You know what? Wow. 
Ace of Pentacles to the Nine of Pentacles. Um, somebody was promised something. Somebody thought that they were going to be able to earn the Ten of Pentacles. They were going to experience some type of level up. But it never happened. Whoever this person chose, they thought it was going to be someone they would have a lot of success with. But it's not working out that way. Something has to do with an agreement. For some of you, these two people are together or got married because of money. It's a very vain relationship. There was never any love there to begin with. That's the only reason why this Five of Swords energy wanted this masculine or feminine. Anyway, it was about the opportunity, the resources. It was never about love. Give me an energy for the Ace of Pentacles. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? For Capricorn, what is the energy? Something has to do with what somebody was promised, though. Like, somebody was promised money, an opportunity, something, but that's not what happened. Whatever this person thought they were going to gain, it didn't work out that way. And it's like, I, you told me, you told me that this was going to happen, but it didn't happen. Somebody feels like they've been lied to. Thank you, spirit. Queen of Swords in reverse. They were bamboozled by this person bamboozled into a relationship so this person for some of you chose to get into a commitment with this five of swords energy because of an opportunity something that they were promised some type of gain this person stood to gain monetarily and that's not how things worked out four of wands somebody got into a full-blown relationship all for the ace of pentacles I feel like this person is realizing that they were doing better by themselves. This person was already independent. So somebody was pretty much being greedy. Somebody was being greedy. And I'm hearing something about my father, my father. So whoever this five of swords energy is in this picture is representing this feminine energy over here. That's what I'm picking up on. Like um, this person has connections. And whoever had an opportunity to be with you thought that they were going to benefit from these connections. So that's why they chose who they chose. Give me an energy for the Queen of Pentacles, but things are not working out. Give me an energy for the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Capricorn? The Ace of Cups. Tell me more. The Six of Cups. In the reverse. You don't have good memories of this person from your past. Confirmation, my phone. You don't. You don't have good memories at all. Um, somebody could have been like kind of shrewd, you know, with their shoulders out again. Somebody could have also been very bossy. Like this person was feeling themselves. It was about the ego. It was about the cloud. And that's why this person is in the situation they're in. What looks good. Somebody wanted to show votes instead of going after something that's real. That's authentic. Give me an energy for the ace of cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Capricorn? What is the energy? Why is the Ace of Cups here for Capricorn? Two of Pentacles. Somebody also wasted too much time. Somebody was being offered the Ace of Cups and they kept playing with it, going back and forth like they couldn't make up their mind. Give me an energy for the Six of Cups. Why is the Six of Cups here for Capricorn? What's the energy? Why is the Six of Cups in the reverse here for Capricorn? What is the message? The Two of Swords. Opposite ends of the earth. 
you and this person are on two different pages. Um, I feel like whoever this other energy is, is representing this masculine over here. I feel like this person is focused on you. Looking at you, like I said, something has to do with your online presence. For some of you, you could have gotten into some type of herbal healing. Or that's something that you are going to be venturing off into, Capricorn. But I feel like you're focused on... Um, your career, business, your money, like your 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 focus on elevating when it comes to your career, your status. Somebody could live in New York, be from New York, but it's like this person watching you, but you're elsewhere. Like you're not even concerned with what's going on. Give me another energy for the two of swords. Death. Yeah, like it's over. I feel like somebody had their time. They had their chance. Again, thank you, Spirit. The star, like you came into this person's life at the perfect time. Something did align. Thank you, Spirit. Like I was saying, like, no, I think you and this person are going to meet, are going to cross paths. This has already happened. And it was this person's time to take that leap, take that risk, but they didn't. Somebody took a major gamble. It was a loss. They kept playing with it. The number two could be significant. Two of Pentacles, two of Swords, somebody could be 22. Something could be significant about the 22nd. Something is significant about a Scorpio. But yeah, a cycle is over. It's like, you know, transform your life type of energy. It's like, okay, well, you missed out on this opportunity, but you can still grow and transform your life. Let's pull a final message. Spirit, give me a final message for Capricorn. What's the energy? But I feel like somebody don't want to let you go still. Like this person knows. I'm telling you, this person watches you. More confirmation. This person watches you, Capricorn. And does a lot of reflecting. Would have, could have, should have energy. Acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times, we must accept things as they are. There's no point trying to change that which is beyond our control. Thank you, Spirit. Confirmation. This person simply just has to accept things for what it is. You know, you can't go back. You can just learn from, you know, the choices that were made and move on. There's no point in trying to change that which is beyond our control and yeah, at this point in time, it is beyond this person's control. Somebody had the key in their hand and they threw it away. So the key is lost. It's gone. I'm also hearing stolen. So for some of you, you're either already in a relationship or something's coming towards you. Somebody going to pick up that key and take it for themselves and use it how it's supposed to be used. But this is your reading. Stay true to thyself. Real with thyself. If you just heard the horn honk after I said that, a lot of confirmation, three confirmations. So something's significant about the number three. Two times with my phone and then the third time with the horn. Somebody could be coming to pick you up, take you out on a date. But stay true to thyself, real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.